while we're out driving, we're constantly approaching intersections. We've already talked about traditional and non-traditional intersections, but there are also controlled and uncontrolled intersections. I've now pulled up to a controlled intersection. A controlled intersection is any intersection where there is a street sign or traffic light that controls the right-of-way at that intersection. At this intersection, the light is red, so I must come to a complete stop, and because there are no signs forbidding a right-hand turn at a red traffic light, if it is clear, I can make a right turn after stopping. The signs that would forbid me for turning would be posted somewhere right here or over here on the corner as you approach the intersection. So when you're deciding if it's legal for you to make a right-hand turn on red, look for the signs in these two locations. Ahead, I'm going to enter an uncontrolled intersection. An uncontrolled intersection has no signs or signals directing who goes first or when to go. Here we'll see how this type of intersection works. As I approach this intersection, I immediately recognized this is an uncontrolled intersection because there was no traffic sign or traffic light posted here, nor was there any type of traffic signal that came up or across over here containing red lights and green lights and all that stuff. So this is a typical uncontrolled intersection. Now, I've pulled into the left lane, so I'm wanting to make a left here. So what do I do? Well, I must first yield to all the cars that would be in this portion of the road. Once this portion of the road is clear, then I can go. I can proceed through with my left-hand turn. Now this vehicle, they will come through and they will have to follow the same rules I do. They will be looking at this portion of the road and once it's clear, they will go. Now, what about this truck over here? Technically, he's last in line. I should get to go first before the truck. So the order of operation here is going to be, I would get to, these cars, sorry, these cars would go first, I would go second, and the truck should go third. Now, I'm going to go ahead and make my left-hand turn because it is clear in this portion of the road. I've now completed my left-hand turn, but I would like to go back and look at that exact same intersection from a different perspective, from the driveway that I pulled into looking onto the bigger street. There's a fundamental rule that's true about yielding in right-of-way, and that is the smaller street or driveway yields to the bigger street. So the cars that are in the driveway that starts at the bottom of your screen will yield to the cars going left and right. So before this car can go, he must look and yield to any cars or traffic coming from this section of the roadway or cars coming from his right if he's going to make a left so that includes this whole section down here, and he must yield to the car in the median like this black car. Now, if he's going to make a left, he would let this black car come first, and if it's clear here and over here, then he could go. Now, sometimes you'll see cars pull out and sort of angle themselves like this. In general, this is illegal, unless this median is 30 feet wide or wider, okay? It's illegal to stop, stand, or park your vehicle in an intersection, and this would be an example of it. It's a law, but it's rarely enforced. As long as you stay in motion when you attempt this maneuver, then you will not be ticketed for it. But it's when you stop in this uh, at this point of the road that you create problems and it could become a ticket because then you're sort of obstructing the flow of traffic. Now, if you're just going to make a right-hand turn onto this road, then the key areas to look 
of course, are going to be down here. All of you do that really well. But then sometimes this guy makes a U-turn. So you've got to check both areas before you can successfully, cautiously make that right-hand turn. And these are the basic rules to yielding and right-of-way when it comes to a car pulling onto a major road or a bigger road from a smaller road.